The International Olympic Committee shocked the sporting world today. It's decided to eliminate an event whose roots reach back to ancient times. Beginning in 2020, wrestling is out of the Olympics. Canada's enjoyed a lot of recent success in that sport, and today some of this country's best lashed out. CBC's Peter Armstrong has the story. Even with their best techniques, these wrestlers will have a hard time beating a foe this big. If the IOC decision stands, wrestling as an Olympic sport will cease to exist after the 2016 Games. This Canadian hopeful simply can't imagine the Olympics without wrestling. You think of Athens, you think of the pictures of the Olympics. In the past, you're just ripping out history. You don't want them to touch you, nothing. Her 17-year-old student was dreaming of competing in the 2020 Games. Games. I won't be able to attain my dream if this happens. That takes away my dreams. Wrestling has been good to this country. Canadian wrestlers have taken home medals in every Summer Olympics since 1992. Officials say the list of sports that are in is based on criteria that includes TV ratings and ticket sales. It is not a case of what's wrong with wrestling. It is what's right with the 25 core sports. But wrestling has always been part of the Olympics. It was part of the original ancient games. Wrestling was part of the reborn modern games in 1896. Now wrestling is being pushed aside to make way for new Olympic sports such as golf. Gold medal, Canada. A decision that infuriates Canada's best-known wrestler. Wrestling should go so we can add rugby or we can add, we can add golf. golf. Golf will now replace wrestling from the Olympics. Around the world, reaction from the wrestling community was similar. From former Soviet states to the United States, wrestling federations began campaigns to get the IOC to change its mind. By the thousands, people signed this hastily organized petition. The decision's not final. A formal vote will be held in September. But remember, internal politics and lobbying have long played a crucial role in the IOC, something wrestling federations hope will at least give them a fighting chance. Peter Armstrong, CBC News, Toronto. As Peter mentioned, the IOC's decision is a big loss for this country. While Canada has never meddled in Greco-Roman wrestling, it's been a different story in freestyle. Canada has won 16 medals in that discipline, two gold, seven silver, and seven bronze, a success story shared by men and women, gold included. Since 1900, wrestlers have won about 6% of Canada's summer medals.